It's all very much doom and gloom at at the moment. Jurgen S has not really performed to the levels you'd expect this season, and heading into the derby against Everton, the potential for an upset is certainly on the cards, if indeed it would even be an upset at this point. When is sitting in 10th place after more than half a season played, of course it's hard to be optimistic. The results are perhaps the most concerning factor, having been beaten heavily by Brentford, Brighton and Wolves in the all in the space of one month. The manner of the losses and the level of the performances have been dire to watch, so it's understandable that everyone around is a little bit somber at the moment. Tottenham suffers huge injury blow as PGMOL admits Arsenal mistake, rivals roundup already has the answer for new Everton as Darwin Nunez ready for the next stage however, put into perspective, things are not all bleak for and his team. We as human beings tend to catastrophize things a lot of the time. And perhaps dooming to failure is a bit of a short-sighted assessment, based too much on recent results, and not on what this team can still achieve. Form is after all temporary. But class is permanent. This is a situation the side has been in before, and it's not entirely impossible that they can get itself out of it again. After all, in 2020-21 when lost six home games on the bounce, things looked perhaps even worse, yet somehow from the depths of despair the club was able to claw its way out and finish in a spot thanks in part to a header by. When comparing this season with that one, S situation right now doesn't seem as bad, especially after certain favorable results over the weekend with the likes of Newcastle United and Tottenham dropping points. There are still 18 games left to play for the Reds, and they have two games in hand. Win those two games in hand, and would go up to potentially 6th or 7th depending on its margins of victory. It would also be just 6 points away from Newcastle United in 4th place, with 15 games and 45 points left to play, including an upcoming clash against the Magpies. That doesn't seem an impossible achievement. S side have overturned a lot worse margins in the past, whether it was in the race for the places or the title. Of course, a revival is needed, but this team is capable of that. This is a team that is still full of world-class players and has a lot of key players returning from injury at just the right time. Virgil van Dijk, Roberto Firmino and Diogo Hoda are all set to return in the next few weeks, and while the injury too is a concern, we'll hope he won't be out for too long either. Now just needs a reaction from his team. Needs to rally together and spur each other on to go on the kind of run that made them formidable for the vast majority of last year. The perfect opportunity for a reaction presents itself against Everton. A big derby win could undoubtedly kickstart S entire season, and we'll be hoping for exactly that come Monday night. Transfer news as Mohamed Salah could be put up for sale amid Jude Bellingham twist Cody Gakpo wants to copy one thing from Virgil van Dijk as he seeks lift off at last. <laughs>